What a number of people are saying these days is that they want a training in inner development and spiritual development that is structured and helps them gain greater vision and uh, wisdom of the nature of the human condition. I had, a, first of all, a degree in social work, but I wanted to work more holistically. And so I studied, went to England and studied Chinese medicine. And that was beautifully holistic. I loved it. But it was very Eastern in, in some of the ways of thinking. And I think a Western consciousness is different. And I kept coming across the um, difficulties that people were having with the mental health team and the mental health situation that they felt often were looking for something else. It's a very much a holistic paradigm. It sees the person as a, um, a living process of becoming where body, soul and spirit inter are always in interaction with each other. And that problems that arise aren't coming from one cause or source only, but, but need to be seen in the context of the person, their life, and themselves uh, in terms of body, soul, and spirit. I never thought when I was beginning it, I had no idea what it would become. Um, and I thought I'd just offer something and see, see if there was a response and a need. And there was, and it's grown, and it's just kept growing. It's for people who want to take this into a professional field and it doesn't have to be counselling and psychotherapy because the training you get at the, here with us is very broad and so it and deep in terms of learning skills for even for organisational change. We have three intensives a year and people are required to come to the beautiful Southern Highlands to do that. <laughs> so they're one week at a time at the beginning of the year, in the middle of the year, and towards the end of the year, it's a three or four day intensive. It's not called an intensive for no reason. There's a intense face-to-face -face work that we, we work with a cohort and we build a strong learning environment, a warm-hearted, supportive, but rigorous environment. Process work is, is a wonderful type of psychology that is experiential and practical. It gives a structure for being uh, to able to read the signals, to unfold the process that's present in the moment for a person and to support them in that process. They have the wisdom within them to know what's right for them. But the, but the process worker or the metavision worker becomes a facilitator to support the unfolding wisdom in their process. The students are absolutely wonderful. The, um, the quality of the student is very high, very stimulating, um, and the discussions can be very, in, very stimulating. The students have a passion for it. And they seem to just thrive and love it and come away with um, a lot of pleasure in the change that they've gone through. It's a very vibrant place, full of colour, full of enthusiasm, uh, depth of um, feeling and perception of each other and a striving towards excellence. There's a woman in, um, in a school in Melbourne where they've traditionally always employed psychologists and they said they wanted her because of her background and because of the way she presented in her interview. There's a, a woman who's working in Western Australia in the um, rural area as a counsellor for the Western Australian Agricultural Board um, because she knows the back, that environment, but she's done this course. A lot of people have set up their own practice 
uh, very successfully. Get on the website and find the application form and fill it in and we'll be in touch. <laughs> I look forward to seeing you. <laughs>